very nice to be back here in the sanctuary. The IndyCard Mafia promising a, re a really big surprise tonight. Not to mention the debut of the Hawaiian cousin of Tamagotchi Motorola. I yes, Tamagotchi Mayavia. Tamagotchi Mayavia. Tamagotchi Mayavia. Maya yes. Anyway, it's Hawaiian. Paul, do you know what's next? I have no idea, but I can't wait. We have wait. a tag team championship match next. From the best tag team on the indie scene, the IndyCard Mafia. Yes, and it was originally scheduled to have the IndyCard Mafia versus the Mighty Militia. But once again tonight, peculiar by his absence, Mike Mitchell is not here. So, we had a couple students come down from the Warriors of Wrestling up in New York. So tonight, those two kids get an opportunity of a lifetime, and they can walk out here as the new tag team champions. Hey, New York, welcome to Pennsylvania, where we know how to wrestle. Let's get it on. Stunt fight, but anyway, ladies and gentlemen, we got a tag team contest coming up right now. Carolina Jim, take us away. Tag titles match. Oh, you want music? It's the first time for our sound guy. We're going to be getting our go a good luck tonight at Chris Benny. And Justin Shaw, Chris Benny known as the living weapon. Now look at these two men getting in the ring, John. They mean business. These two young men from New York coming down here ready to go. Without a doubt in my mind, they are here to stunt fight. They're here to wrestle. They're here to fight. They want to leave with those tag team belts. They sure do, Paul. What an opportunity for them. And hear one of the most significant messages given to us. These guys can walk out as the tag champs tonight. They send the Indicard Mafia. I wouldn't say walk out. Hard fight, absolutely. Well, there is one half of the Sanctuary Tag Team Champions. And there's Eric the better half coming down the aisle. There's a lot more belts on him than how many belts these guys got? I got four belts, five Two belts, six belts. All those belts just mean success. Look at the IndyCard Mafia right now. These men apparently can you say, belts can you say tag team champions? Look at how many belts they have. Not one, not two, not three, not four, not five, but six. Six different championship belts from all over the independent scene. More belts than Macy's, and they've earned every single one of them. This is the premier tag That's an team. Impressive. Beat. An impressive feat by the IndyCard Mafia. It's like every time I see the IndyCard Mafia, they just keep adding championship to championship. Fight. It's set for fall, and it is for the Sanctuary Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers, Wade. Let's try this again. Weighing in at a combined weight of 425 pounds from Brooklyn, New York, Chris Benet and the living weapon, Jason Sinclair. Their opponents first. At ringside, Mirage. She brings to the ring tonight, weighing in a combined weight of 420 pounds. Oh, I have no hard mic anymore. Southern California. Oh, that's all right. This is all the mic you need. Sanctuary Tag Team Champions, Eric Eminine, the Project Thomas Brewington. 
Indy Card Mafia. New York boys, welcome to Pennsylvania. You're fighting the absolute best. I'll tell you what. The Indy Card Mafia, also, by the way, from New York, Buffalo, New York, just the other end of the state. Uh, I got to tell you, though. Showing Buffalo, New York is all about winning championships. Look at all those belts. There is so much gold there. These guys look like they broke into Fort Knox. Fort Knox asked them for gold, but let's be serious for a second right now. The Indy Card Mafia is here to stump fight. Now you're getting at the stunt fight. And making no bones about it right now. And these two rookies taking it right to the champions right now. Not going to get pushed around. It's a hard I wish ripping to the corner right now. Look at this, John. This is impressive. I can't believe our champions are getting manhandled like this. Look at how aggressive these two young going right for the fight right now. Right into the count of one, two. Breaks up the count. That could have been over that quick. Two or three quarters. That could have been champions. it. It would have been minus two belts right wrestling. there. Did not come to play. Oh my God! He may have knocked him out. Where is the wrestling coming here to fight? And they're taking it right to the Indycar Mafia really right now. Hard but shots. right now, the Indycar Mafia doing what they do best. And he's able to escape. Look at that! It, it was Buster. Buster. What's up, Art Anderson? Two count barely kicked out of that, John. Look at this. This is color me impressed right I am, now. I'm just gonna say I'm very impressed. With these two debuting members here, these two new tag team. New tag team putting their name on the map already, taking it right to the IndyCar Mafia right now. Oh, it looks like they're slowing it down though. Nice but the ring's team. about to get cut in half and the IndyCar Mafia is gonna show you why they are the tag team champions of about nine different federations. I counted at least three to six there, Paul. I'm rounding up. Tonight? And I mentioned I failed math. I was just going to say, I'm pretty confident that's that's not how you're around. Beautiful snap, Marin. Watch this. Look at this. Low clothesline right into the cover. Very Look at that. Though, equally effective as a standing clothesline because he threw his entire body mass into him. And right into the pin. Did not give him any time to recover right now. And I got to say, I'm impressed by both teams right now. Look at this. Fighting his way up and unfortunately knocked right down, but he's getting right back up. Tag Team Champions definitely taking control right now. But this hot young tag team from the other part of New York is holding their own. And right now into the tree of woe. Got a smack to the face right now. And a low drop kick raising the ire of the living weapon right now. The referee trying to gain control in this kind of match. But... You, in this kind of match, it's going to be hard because all four of these men are jockeying for a position to be the best. One, two. Kicks out of two. I got to hand it to this young tag team just hanging in there right now. But absorbing an amazing amount of punishment. Another cover. One, two. And a breakup. Chris Penne and Justin Shaw definitely hanging in there. Definitely hanging in there with the tag team champions right now. But sometimes that's just not enough. IndyCard Mafia just showing dominance right now. Established dominance early in this stunt fight. This young man trying to make a comeback here. Beautiful European uppercut. And gets a stiff forearm to the face and a chop for his actions. The card mafia is wearing down the competitors right now, wearing down the competition. But the competition hanging in there, he has not gone off his feet except for now. Another beautiful spine buster and just being worked over right now, beaten down. And the Indicard Mafia mocking the sanctuary congregation. And I can't say that. Beautiful kicks to the chest right now. And answers with a super kick of his own. Textbook swinging net breaker. This could be at one, two, kick out at two and three quarters. No quit in this tag team.
The Warriors really hanging in there. Comeback he's staging and gets another super kick for his actions. Beautiful, beautiful spinning forearm shot. This could be it. Go for the cover. You're going to win the belts. Come on. All you have to do is roll over. Come on. Double knockout right now. We could be see. Uh, both men starting to show life right here, trying to get to their respective corners. Mirage bringing it to the referee's attention that the, the tag was not made. The, the IndyCard Mafia being taken a task right now. One, two, three, four. And the referee recognizing that the tag was not made. I finally like that we have a referee with glasses that can call this down the middle. John, the IndyCar and Mafia really, really getting taken to task tonight. I'm amazed. I apologize, Paul. Production keeps breaking down, but we're going. We're still live on YouTube. You can break us down, but you can't stop us, John. And that goes for the State Athletic Commissioner, that asshole. Well, you know. I I'm sorry to bring that up right now. You know, but watch this double team words. move by the any crowd mafia right now. I'm not saying I disagree. I'm just saying I'm not agreeing. I'm not, I'm not going to go on the record with that right now. I can because they can't sue me. I don't think they can. I'm not sure that's freedom of speech. <laughs> They're still trying to sue me, but what do they know? Uh oh. John, right now they're this turning might be up it. This, this might be it. it. This might be it. Great showing by this tag team. They have nothing to be embarrassed about. Oh! But nobody's going to survive that. One, two, three. You know, as much as I try to be impartial, I have to hand it to this young tag team. They stepped up to the plate. They might have lost tonight, but they stepped up. I don't think anybody... But they lost. Yeah. I don't think the IndyCard Mafia... I don't think they expected this big of a challenge here at the Sanctuary tonight. They came within a second a few times of losing those Sanctuary Tag Team Championships. That should be that should be a notice to the IndyCard Mafia. We keep getting tag teams in here like this. They're going to have to prove it every week they're the champions, but they do. Eric Eminon is demanding that they show respect for their champions. I don't think the people in Hazleton know the meaning of the word respect, but you know what? They have to go to the IndyCard Mafia because they are the champions. Still an amazing contest. An amazing contest, an amazing challenge tonight. That's what you get when you come to the Sanctuary Stunt Studio. And this is only our second stunt fight of the night. I like them. I know you like them. They got a lot of stuff. They got they got a lot of cleanup. It's not easy to transport 80 pounds of gold. They're trying their best. Well, while they're they're cleaning up their gold, I gotta 